Hello Dreamers, we're going to do the Sands in the Hourglass quest. If this video helps you, please like it. Leave a silly comment for the algorithm and don't subscribe to me. Alright, to get through here, you gotta use your magic wand to clear out the floating debris. And then we need to talk to Jafar over here. Okay, so it's telling us to search for lost treasure by pressing space. So I'm gonna press space and wander around a little bit and see if I can find something. Okay, I think I figured out how it works. When you press space, you're gonna see a color. I think the color represents whether you're hot or cold to the item, all right? So as you see, this just means neutral and then blue must mean cold. So now that it's gold, when it goes to gold, it should mean that you are getting closer and then a red will mean that you're really close, I believe. So we got to press E continuously, and there we go, we found our first fragment. Okay, so let's go around and just keep looking for some gold. See some red there. There we go. And there we go, we found another one. So just pay attention to the colors. Alright, so now we got to go to the ancient landing and we got to find more. All right, so I'm looking around this area here. This is where I am on the map, though I have a feeling that this could be different depending on where, uh, you know, it could be random. It might not be in the same spot for you. All right, so actually what I'm also noticing is that we got to follow, look at where the particles are moving. So let's follow the particles. Yeah, I think that's also part of it. You see, there's no particles, but look where those particles are moving. So let's follow them. Nice, okay. And there we go. Actually, it's not so hard once you pay attention to the particles. Alright, let's follow the particles again. There we go. Nice. Alright. No more treasure here. We gotta look somewhere else. Okay, it's nice that it even tells you that. So let's head back to the beach area, and we'll see if we can find some more treasure. Is there any here? Alright. So again, we're just following the particles. There we go. Good stuff. Alright, keep looking. There we go. We're looking for ancient plates, plates, apparently. Though apparently there's a certain amount of treasure in each area. I wonder if it like responds after a period of time. All right, there's another ancient plate. Perfect. Let's go ahead and head this way now. Follow the particles. Looks like we gotta cross the bridge. Oh, back here, back here. Where are you? There you are. Alright, that was just a weird vial. Somewhere around here. There we go. All right, that's the last plate. Now we just need to return to Jafar at the secluded beach, which is back over here. All right, after you talk to him, we got to use the detailed repair instructions in my inventory. So he hands you this. Let's go ahead and use it. All right. So we need to craft the statue's arm. Let's go into quest, statue's arm, ancient fragments. This is all stuff that I found while I was uh, searching for treasure. Good stuff. Put the statue's arm back in the socket. Here you go, buddy. Nice. All right. We gotta return to Jafar at the Broken Bridge area in the courtyard. Okay, looks like we need a certain amount of mist to repair it. 
All right, so you get the mist from the... Uh, actually, it's kind of like the new dream light. So you can get a lot of in the mist duties. Uh, do quests and stuff like that. Well, I already got 2,000, so let's go ahead and open her up. Here you go, buddy. Very cool. All right, looks like that quest is complete. If this video helped you, please like it. Leave a silly comment for the algorithm and don't subscribe to me.